Hello and welcome back everyone to Let's Play Fallout 3. Last time, we met these delightful people here in the Outcast Bunker. And now we've got to uh, run a bit of a simulation to unlock their toys. Or rather, my toys. So let's go! Into the Egg of Death. like the pinnacle of gaming right here. I want one of these simulation pods. Hey! Hey! Wake up! Mm. Come on! Snap out of it! That was a hell of a nasty fall you took. When your shoot bunched up like that, I thought you were a goner. I hope the other guys made it. I don't think their patrol spotted us coming in. So at least we still have the jumper. You still have your gear. So I'm gonna let you make the call. You can go in quiet, but guns blazing. We'll still meet at the rendezvous point inside, as planned. Then we'll blow those artillery guns to hell. Just watch yourself. The Reds up here don't take prisoners. Good luck. You too. Here we are, Operation Anchorage. While well, that guy crawls up the side of the mountain, I am going to sneak around here. Now, just a word on the gameplay of this. Operation Anchorage ends up playing much like a more dedicated first-person shooter, like a Far Cry. That, um... Sense the uh, auto animations and stealth takedowns, of course, but it's like I should be able to hit this guy with one shot and he'll die. Or not. There we go. Always double tap. But yeah. <laughs> oh shit! Ugh. But yeah. The controls and just general gameplay of this are a lot tighter and smoother than in the base game. Hi there. There we are. And of course he fizzles out. Yeah, it's like, even with a fully repaired silenced 10 mil pistol in the base game, you just would not be able to one-shot a guy like that, even with sneak, sneak attack critical. You're not letting off that gun. And they're on caution now. Shit. I kinda wish I could speak Chinese, just so I knew what these dudes were saying. Right. There you are. You're not gonna be a problem for me for a little while. Let's go down here, grab ourselves a sniper rifle. Don't need any mines. Now, does that sniper rifle come with ammunition? Yes, it does. 24 rounds. Nice. Alright. Trench knife. So that like Ooh yeah. Long blade. On the back serrations. Alright. Stop admiring your weapons and actually get your head in the game. Ooh. Who's there? Who is the wise guy? Give me the clash of the cough. Thank you. Ooh, nades. Gimme. Also, notice that uh, I actually have to mouse over the model itself to get the pickup option. In the base game, I can just put my cursor about here and grab everything on the table. 
Alright. There you are. Jeez, this is starting to get like Far Cry Hardcore. Ooh, hi. And bang! Nice! Oh yeah, he pierced. Two shots, and he's dead. Alright, now, I'm pretty sure there's a Gauss rifle around here somewhere. Ooh, stealth boy, that could come in handy, maybe. What will come in even more handy is once I complete this thing. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Jackass, stop that. Paint the cliff with your brains. Anyway, as I was saying, one thing that will come in really useful once I finish this will be the Chinese stealth armor. That stuff is awesome. And with a high sneak skill and silent running, some might say it's insanely OP. And I'd be inclined to agree. <laughs> Yeah, so, once again, my game crashed. Oh shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Get below him. Show me your face. Alright, come around there. I can play that. So yeah, once again, I'll ask if any of you know how to make this more stable, please let me know. Ah, shit. Alright. Nice. <sighs> Continuing. So, what was the sound before? Oh, ah, yeah, this Chinese stealth armor. With high enough skills and the right perks, it is OP, but I love it. Oh shit, here we go. Crash oh. flat. And now, F5, so if we crash again, I don't have to trip through the entire thing. Aha. Sneaky, sneaky. And I think at this point I've got a sneak of 90. What are you... Oh. That was one of my guys. I wish there was a lean. <gasps> There's a guy right there. from here if you can stop freaking out like that maybe there's the gas rifle hi there dude nice that's how you do it yoink ooh ooh yeah give me all this stuff Let's give the Plasnikov a go, shall we? There he is. Let's see how it is with accuracy. Not too shabby. A bit too loud for my taste. Hi. You see nothing. You see nothing. Okay. Now we'll take the high ground. I think I'm going sort of the right way. 
This looks like a perfect place for an ambush. Aha, yeah. This is where I'm going. And I apologize if this is going a bit slow. But if there's one thing I know about Operation Anchorage, it's that it favors a very methodical, very much more militarized approach to things. So, oh yeah, you're just a badass. God damn, this place is swarming with reds. I almost didn't make it. Glad to see you're still in one piece. Yeah. I almost bought it out on the cliffs. Didn't know the Reds were so handy with a sniper rifle. So, what's the situation? We clear to blow the hell out of this place? Yep, let's go. I got your six. Thank you. All right. Give me the Klasnikov. Wait a minute, what's he got? Ah oh, yes, he's got the, um, SIG 550 MP5 cross. All right, let's get our Whoa. sniper. Watch your step on those ledges. That is a hell of a Yep, it sure is. <clears throat> Eyes on. We got company up there. Contact. Two reds. Should have connected. I had eyes on. Perfect shot. Ooh. In the neck through the window. Bad day for you. Alright. Yeah, really, the only control. Operation Anchorage is missing is a lean function. We're crossing that pipe. And here I thought I was the one with the death wish. Uh-huh. I want to see what this dude had in here. And also, if anyone is from Alaska in here, I'd like to know are all these pipes and fortifications are these real or just for the um, purpose of the game because I'm about as far from Alaska as you can probably get Ooh. what's in here decrypt okay so that's talking about uh, yeah, spy infiltrating the forces. Okay, nothing really interesting in here. All right, there's a dude just around here. Let's give the knife a go. Ha! Oh shit! Surprise! And down he goes. Let's get back from the lay. Hey, 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 hey. You don't get that close. Alright, there's another dude up here. And. Wait, where is he? Ooh, I saw it. Man, that camouflage actually works. That's kind of weird. Come on, bastards! There we are. All right. Now before we advance, maintain cover. Hi there, Kushblat. Now, no other contacts. Move up. Get across the bridge as fast as possible. Contact left. Oh, big contact left. Oh. Move up. Ah. 
high. Montgomery's saying something, but I didn't hear. Grab all the ammo. I haven't used the gas rifle yet. Alright. Charging straight up along that bridge is a bad idea. Especially since I can see on the radar, yeah, turrets. See, so we're gonna go sneaky sneaky through the cave passage. Whoa. Can't imagine how cold this must be in here. Contact. Alright, I think we can dispatch him with a sniper rifle. <laughs> Boom. That would probably result in some hearing damage. In a space like this. But then, it's a game, we don't worry about such things. Yeah, here we are, now we've got the drop on them. Now the clash in the cough once again. Oh yeah. Oh shit. We have been spotted. Oh, I see flamers. Nice. Where is it? Oh, there you are. Give me a shot. Thank you. Come on. Come on. They're scurrying. They know we're here. Alright, this is probably a very stupid idea, but... Charge! With the clash the off. You take the left, I'll take the top. Hi! Uh oh. Hello. Wreck your day. Montgomery's light and deep Come on. Is that all you got? Whoa. He was shooting his own turret. Weird. Alright, can I hack this? Yes, I can. Thank you, science. Eh, yeah, whatever. Not important. Now, is there a health thing around here? Because I don't have any stims. Yes, there is. Nice. Alright, now. Is this the place with the Crimson Dragoons? And get down, Sergeant. Ooh, hi. See you up there. Do you see me? Ooh. And there's the guns. Uh oh. Over there. Over there. Get him. Nice. And why don't you have a silenced weapon? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on. Pump you full of bullets. That's a nice touch. Whoa. Uh. He saw nothing. As did you. There we are. About freaking time. Ooh. Missiles. Yet I've never come across a missile launcher. Alright. No one in here? Good. Oh yeah. All right, give me the cash to have. Holy shit! Whoa! Sniper rifle. That's a cool tank. There was actually a vehicle designed with that sort of propulsion system. 
and I forget what it actually managed to accomplish, but it was something pretty amazing. I think it was the first vehicle to get from something like Greenland to the Arctic Circle or there. something crazy like that. See him down there? That's a damn kind of taste. Yeah. Don't worry, they're well out of range. You're not. Face! You need to move up. Just that one dude. Hi there. I see you over there. Damn it. Out of range. It's really annoying how it does that. Uh oh. Who's got eyes? You've got eyes. And now you've got no arm. Right back to the Great Wall if I have to. All right, that was a pretty stupid move on my part. And before we go up there, it's in here. Interesting stuff. Ooh, intel. Yoink. And more grenades. I don't think I've ever actually used grenades in this. Alright. No contacts as of yet. Ooh, yes, we have contact. Sniper rifle. God damn don't it. Don't let one of these commies get away. Nice. Come on. I should have hit you. I did hit you. Alright. Where are you going? Why would he pull back? Alright, let's just rush the position. Go from cover to cover. There you are. No more brain. Didn't have many to start with. And this is starting to get a bit long. Hmm. Looks like the commies are getting low on ammo for the big guns. You call this low on ammo? Oh shit! I'm gonna push you past the great There we are, there's one. And there you are. Over there. It's like Get Chinese whack a mole. Over there. Over there. Get Reel your face. Uh. Going weapons free around these things is probably not a good career choice. Contact. Come on. Show me. Where are you? Alright. Oh yeah, health. Don't really need it, but I'll take it. Alright, I'm pretty close to the guns, so we should be able to get those out of the way in this episode. At the very least, we'll get near them. I don't think there's anything worthwhile down that way. Okay. I was wrong. This is the way we need to go. Oh, contact. Over there. Over there. Jinx. Push bread. In game, this thing's firing 556. In real life, it would be firing 762 by 39. Either one of those at that range should have exploded his head in one shot. Oh, 
Alright, we're getting very close to the guns. Ah, here we are. This is where Vance comes in real handy. Crimson Dragoons. Yeah, I, so I was wrong. Let's keep moving. Alright, because these dudes are cloaked. Ha ha! I see you! Yeah, so you use vats to find out where they are. Then you can see them through the scope. And. And. Well, apparently their armor is very good. Right, shut your leg off. Whoa, hi! Not very stealth assassin there. Whoa. Hi. Uh -huh. Over there. Nice. No idea how Vats is even able to target them when they're cloaked. But as I said before, it's a game we don't question it. It's basically like pinging active sonar, except it's like scanning the area instantly. Alright, I think we're clear. Ammo, health. Artillery Overlook. Just F5 for safety. We have contact. That's the front down there. These guns are pounding on our guys. Let's take them out. Ooh, there you are. And headshot. Yeah. These are massive guns. And I would be more than deaf right now. Now. Ooh, you just walked around that corner at exactly the wrong time. Bastards. All right. Plant. Plant explosives Let's go. and run. Run, 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 run. Run, run. And boom. 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 Hell yeah. Boom. Take that, you red bastards. All right, continuing. Shit. Nice. Get out of my Got a I love the minimal spread on these weapons. Like, especially with the Stire in the base game. Well, the modded Stire in the base game. The spread is just horrendous. I looked into the data files of the Stire, actually, and its spread is 4 degrees. Ow. 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 Oh, flame it, flame it. You just stop that. I'm burning. Right. You're there, you're there. I heard a sniper. Where's that sniper? You're not a sniper. I think Montgomery took care of the sniper. Yeah, ammo. Give me. All right, we should have just enough time in this episode to. Ooh. Take care of both these guns. All right. 
gonna find us around. Explosive charge set. Let's go, 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 go. Here's the last one. So when that one goes boom. Let's blow this piece apart. Here we are. That's two. Kaboom. Let's finish the job. And in about 15 seconds. Oh shit. See him. Cub. Boom. And I just splattered you. And there we go. All right. Damn fine work you did taking out those guns. Damn fine. Thank you, sir. No need to thank me. I know a genuine, true-blooded soldier when I see one. And that's why I sent you. Unfortunately, while you were up there climbing mountains, we were down here getting our butts kicked. The Chinese decided to use our field HQ for target practice, and damn near blew us all to pieces. We lost some good men, including my strike team commander, Colonel Patterson. Anything I can do to assist? I didn't call you down here for a pep talk and cigars. You've earned yourself a field promotion, soldier. As of this moment, you're taking over Patterson's strike team. And before you thank me, you better wait and see what your mission entails. What are my orders, sir? There are three hardened targets that stand between us and the Chinese headquarters. That's where your strike team comes in. Follow me over to the situation map and I'll bring you up to speed. The general is very anxious to speak with you. Okay. Okay. Pay attention, soldier. I'm only gonna go through this once. We've set up our new field HQ down here. The area is pretty secure now that the artillery guns are gone. The first of the three targets we need to handle is their Chimera Depot over here. Be careful on your approach. You're gonna have to get through the enemy camp on the way. Once you breach the perimeter of the depot, you need to take out both of the main fuel tanks. Your second target is all the way over here. The Chinese have set up a listening post set into the side of Callaway Ridge. There are some abandoned mines along the route, so keep your eyes and ears open. It's a great place for an ambush. You need to clear the place of personnel, so we can get our intelligence boys in there to start decoding. Once the first two targets are down, the last obstacle standing in the way is their damn pulse field. You need to cross it then cause it to overload, so we can mop up the place with the T-51Bs. Let me warn you now, unless you have some sort of a death wish, I wouldn't even go near the field until the first two targets are down. Lieutenant Morgan will be your eyes and ears for Operation Anchorage, so get everything else you need from him. Uncle Sam's invested a lot of money turning you into a killing machine. Time to pay him back. Dismissed. Thank you, sir. What are we looking at for losses if we pull this off? Oh, I'd things just got real. Sensor, so, we'll continue this in the next episode. The Until then, good, good. thank you all for joining me for this Keep episode of Let's Play Fallout 3. Let me know when Until next time, the pulse see you field. later. Sir.